morning we're going up to Volcano. It's gonna take like three, four hours to go up and then two hours to descend. We got dropped off right here by the little bus, which I think overcharges a lot. <laughs> it was like two dollars per person. Yeah. I really doubt the people that were in the bus paid that much. But uh, we're so unprepared for this. We have, well, he has water, but we don't have any food or anything. Nothing, one banana left. So we'll try to carry up so we don't, we don't walk on the sun and get dehydrated. <laughs> So we just reached one and a half kilometers out of 13. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's not really steep, but it's it's in an incline all the way up. Yeah, it's always joining us over here. It's crazy how they listen to him. Dude, they're like dogs. Dude. They actually do what he tells them. So right now we made it to 10 kilometers. We're 11. We're almost there. We are like two kilometers away. There's some crazy people over there. There's some crazy animals in this jungle. The clouds are coming down too. Actually, when we pick, I think it's going to be full of clouds. That's crazy that they had a road here before you. The wet season destroyed everything. All throughout the way, it was just rocks. <laughs> now there's like a road on the highest part of it. Yeah, it's not too hard. It's like a what? No, it's just. It's like 45? Yeah. No, 40 mm, degrees? Like, no, 45 is fucking deep. Yeah. Like, probably it's just like around 30, 30 35. Max, but it's always like yeah. never stop, you know, never have a break. Just. We have made it. Success. The last, what, the last three kilometers were bitch. Like the worst ever, like, I don't know if it's the worst ever of my trekking of my life, but like the most difficult one. Yeah. It's pretty hard. And then the last, like, half a kilometer it was really steep. We're here. This is the crater of the volcano. It's inactive, so. It sucks a little bit, but anyway, it's more for the challenge of the yeah. trekking. Yeah, I was, we did it. Yeah. And that's it. So it counts. Now we gotta see if we can make it the way down. <laughs> that's a challenge right there. Yeah, after uh, a nap. Yeah, we're, we're gonna, gonna make a nap, sure. We're gonna chill here for a while, because there's no way we can make it right now. <laughs> I'm die. <laughs> Shit, my knees shaking. You guys look right there. It's a lot of trash and that pisses me off. When we were walking right here, there was a lot of trash too. And it's just like, dude, if you're gonna, if you bring up a water bottle, just, just now it's gonna be empty, so it's gonna weigh nothing. So you just fucking take it back down. I don't understand why people bag of chips like that weights nothing and shit in the middle oh yeah and then the shit in the middle of the fucking trail the fuck yeah, man, you're stupid, that. You're stupid like a dog yeah if you guys ever go hiking don't do that that's, that's fucked up so this is the other side of the mountain of the volcano now if you truly wanted to make it all the way up there we still have to hike like a little bit more but the thing is like it's so cloudy that we won't be able to see anything because um, you're actually supposed to be able to see the Pacific and the Caribbean side if you go all the way up there but it's, it's really cloudy it wouldn't matter like, we're just here chilling we're gonna, I'm gonna take a nap because there's no way we can make it down straight up so it took us four hours and a half to get up here and we're thinking it's going to take us two hours, two hours and a half to get down. Yeah. So we got to rest before we go down. And we didn't, I haven't told you guys, but we, well, I didn't bring any water or food. <laughs> and he didn't bring any food, and just a little bit of water. Yeah, and one banana. And one banana. Fuck. So that was a mistake. Yeah, totally. So yeah, we, we got to hurry back down and eat something. 
can. Oh, here comes the sun. Fuck. <laughs> Holy crap. Dude. Fucking raining, man. <laughs> we got caught up in the rainforest. Yeah. This is why it's called the rainforest. Yeah, it's like the worst thing, uh, not the worst, but like bad things that can happen now with this. <laughs> Fuck. But we'll make it. Yeah, shit happens, you need to deal with it, so. Yeah. So it was raining really hard when we first started descending. Yeah, everything was getting muddy and stuff. So it was pretty hard to get down, dangerous. But now we're like in this drier area. And we're only like three kilometers from the exit. So I can't wait to get there. My knee is killing me. And also his knees are fucked up. <laughs> Guys, so we finally made it down. And I can't tell you how fucking nice it is. Yeah. To be in flat ground because... I have enough. Fucking 26 kilometer man, going up and goes down. Fucking and the rain's coming and I have a shitload of mud everywhere. And they have like... I don't know how much thousand and thousand rock on the path is like incredible. I was telling him I never realized how good Colorado trails are because in Colorado they're cleaned off. Like all the rocks, all of those rocks are gone. Like they put them on the side. So it's really, I've, I've climbed high, higher in like more yeah. difficult terrain, but Same it's thing really nice. Same thing for information. Same yeah. thing. Civilized country, I think so. So actually, you might think this is low, but since the terrain is so hard, it's actually harder to do these ones. And I can tell you my knees will agree with it, because my knees are busted from just climbing that crap. And just so you guys know that, vol that volcano is called Baru. So you guys, since we uh, we didn't have any food up there, we forgot to bring food and water. That's we just ate a large one and a large one. one. That's what happened when you forget to bring food, man. You're starving. <laughs> yeah, I fucking ate that thing so quick, what, like in 10 minutes? <laughs> 